And to up the ante even more, a style and haircut from Johnny Capello. Johnny, I know what you're going to say. Get rid of this headband. Oh, no! Oh my goodness, look at this brillo head. Elizabeth's hair was dry and brittle because the gray hair is naturally dry. Her curly hair is naturally dry. So when you combine the two, it makes it all that much more dry. The plan for Elizabeth is first to work with her hair color, putting a nice base in there and putting some golden tones to warm up her face. With Elizabeth's haircut, what I did was layer it just to create some height in it. And I beveled the bottom just to create some continuity around her face. Here you go, my love. Oh my God. What do you think? Oh my God. Johnny, I have to pinch you. Let me pinch you because I don't believe it's me. I am excited. I am happy. This one is really transformation. I can't even say what I'm feeling, but look at that. And it's not over yet, as it was on to makeup artist Corby Banner. Okay, Elizabeth, let's get the glasses off. Okay. What? You've been hiding these cheekbones. I am. Amazing. Beautiful. Elizabeth has fantastic bone structure, cheekbones and jawline, for example. She has smaller eyes and lips. That's what we need to play up to make her really look beautiful. I chose steel gray for Elizabeth's eye makeup because it echoed her beautiful blue eyes without competing with them. I'm stroking some thin liquid eyeliner right at the base of your eyelashes and taking it just a stroke beyond your natural eye to extend it and give it an elegant almond shape. Now I'm taking the steel gray eyeshadow and going over that eyeliner to set it and give it a smoky, sultry edge. Elizabeth has smaller lips and the way to address them is first to lubricate the lips. I used a great conditioner all the way around the mouth and slightly beyond. That provided a silky surface to glide the pencil around to contour the mouth and I filled it in with a beautiful gloss to give it gleam and highlight. Yeah! Oh my God! I love it! Elizabeth's makeover journey is now up. Stick around because when we come back, we're going to find out what kind of first impression she makes with the jury the second time around. And what will husband Rocco think of his new wife? In moments, Elizabeth will enter the studio and face the jury for the final time. We have a little twist. We've brought in a brand new jury, and they have no idea that Elizabeth has had a makeover. Jury, take your seats. On our jury today, a personal trainer, a retired teacher, an actor. Our secret juror today is Elizabeth's husband, Rocco. Here comes Elizabeth. Hi, you look stunning. Smashing. Our jury watched, they listened, they deliberated. Elizabeth was a class act. Then the jury made their comments as her proud husband listened on. Elizabeth, you've been here before, so you know very well what's happening behind the two-way mirror, don't you? Yes. Elizabeth, here's the kind of first impression you make right now. Take a look right over here. Wow. Wow. Amazing. Oh, Perfect. Oh, really nice. Adorable. Very I love the hair. I love the highlights. Oh, look at she has a beautiful oh, smile. Oh, look at that. Oh, it's yeah, radiant. Yeah, teeth are so nice. Very confident, classy looking lady. She reminds me of Candace Bergen. Yeah. Or a young Angie Dickinson. That's yes. 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 Her yes. husband is a very lucky man. <laughs> <laughs> and there you go. The jury has spoken. How do you feel? I'm just on top. <laughs> the feeling just amazing. And um, my attitude changed. I have confidence. I feel like a diamond. I am strong. What will you take away from this experience? I just now know how to feel and look my best. And that was my dream. When Elizabeth came in seven days ago, our jury thought she looked old and tired. She went from the assembly line to the couture line in this funky suit. Her stained chip teeth were given an overhaul with veneers and a partial denture. Contact lenses and cosmetic fillers revealed a more youthful face. And trimming and styling her unruly hair added sophistication. Now this former auto worker is ready to rev her life into overdrive. Elizabeth. There is one more person on the jury that wants to say something to you. Okay. You want to hear it? Okay. Okay. Here it is. Hello, JB. Oh. It's me, your secret juror. You look fantastic. I know 
that we have been uh, struggling lately, but we will make it. I am very proud of you. You mean the whole world to me. You will always be a model to me. Oh. I love you very, very, very much. Oh, I love you too. And here he is. Come on in, Rocco. There he is. Oh. <laughs> hey. <laughs> What's the biggest change you see in your wife? The smile, the face. Doesn't she look beautiful? For more on Style by Jury, go to WNetwork.com. Rocco, what would you like to say to your wife now that you have her right here in front of you? You are very, very uh, beautiful. Oh. I love you so much. I love you too. Oh, I love those nice moments. Why don't you two hug? Oh, yes. I love that. Yes. All right. Mm -hmm. Jury, you're dismissed.